What is up, guys? This is Godlike Matt, and I'm here to show you guys uh, something you might want to know because I know I really wanted to know. Uh, as you can see, I am wearing the completed full set of heavy synth armor, and I know some of you may be wondering how the fuck do you get this armor? Because it's actually pretty hard to find if you're just trying to loot it. There's not that often on an occasion where you run into synth enemies that are wearing this armor. But the key is, as, as you can see here, you need to have unlocked the Institute, which means you need to have done a certain amount of uh, quests uh, in the main quest storyline, so main story missions, uh, not side quests or anything like that. You need to have opened up the Institute, and the only way to do that is through the main story quest. Now, once you've opened up the Institute, uh, this is the main hub. Um, whenever you quick jump here, this is where you're going to end up. As you can see, um, this room is differentiated by the four symbols on the uh, on the tops of the doors and the archways. The green one is the one you want to be under because there's this neat little guy here, a synth, and he's a shopkeeper. So he's uh, he can be pretty difficult to find if you don't know where the fuck he is, which is why I'm making this video. It took me forever to find this dude. I didn't even know he was here until recently. But you go into the shop, and as you can see, um, under apparel, he has and sells the Heavy Synth armor. Now, he won't always have all the pieces. It's pretty random, depending on, you know, if you ever want him to change his stock or get, like, let's say he sells most of the pieces but not all of them, like, kind of like he does here. Uh, you'll have to, like, you know, buy these pieces and then wait out a certain amount of time. So just go do some quests or something. Or keep sleeping 24 hours if you want him to... If you're not in the mood to wait for him to change. And, uh... Yeah, eventually his he'll change what he sells. You just, it's just a matter of time. I don't know exactly how long you have to wait for him to do it. But it does work. Because uh, that's how I got the full set. At first he didn't sell all the pieces. And gradually over time I got the last few that I was missing. And now I am wearing the completed... And full set, as you can see, looks pretty awesome. Which is why I imagine a lot of you will want it. Which is why I wanted it, because it looks sick. And, yeah, that's how you get the heavy synth gear. Because I know a lot of you guys must be wondering how, because it's very impractical to get this entire set off of synths. Not only do you rarely see them even wearing the armor, but uh, they may not ever have the pieces. It's just completely luck based so this is how you actually find the pieces manually and get them yourself Th as far as I know this is the only way to get them through like a shop this is the only vendor I know that sells them there may possibly be others but um, this one's fairly easy to get to all you gotta do is just the main story until you get to the Institute and BAM uh, you'll have access to it Sorry guys, just chiming in quickly again because I totally forgot to mention, um, this is a rather important tidbit. If you guys come to this vendor and he's not selling the heavy synth armor, if he's selling, uh, the, uh, the lower tiers like sturdy or just normal synth armor, there's a reason for that. If you guys didn't know, there are three different tiers, as I said, there's just normal synth armor, there's sturdy synth armor, and then there's heavy, heavy being the best, offering the most defensive stats, also the heaviest. But um, there's these three different tiers of armor. Um, it's the case with every armor. It's the same with leather. There's normal, sturdy, and heavy with leather, metal, synth, and combat armor. All of them have the three separate tiers. And uh, if you come to this guy and he's not selling the heavy variant, the reason for that is probably because you're not high enough level. His stock changes depending on how high level you are. Uh, me, personally, I'm pretty damn high level. I'm level 56. And, uh, yeah, so just take note of that. I have no idea when he starts selling the heavy variant, but you have to be decently high level for him to offer it. So, if you guys are wondering why that's an issue, it's probably because you're not high enough level. Again, I don't know exactly what level it is, um, because I'm getting this armor fairly late into the game. But, that's the case. And uh, also another reminder I wanted to throw out there, if you guys have any requests, any at all, about Fallout or any game whatsoever, um, let me know, drop it in the comments, and uh, I will definitely consult, and it could very well happen, if you will it. So, 
uh, yeah, that's it. So anyways, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope this helped you out if you were really wondering about the synth gear. It is really good gear. It's arguably the best uh, gear you can wear over top of um, thin clothing because this is one of the gears that, as I said, uh, there's select clothes in the game you can wear underneath the armor pieces. and uh, But not all armor sets are like that. Some of them completely come in one package deal but uh it's usually better to wear the armor like this because you get more stats and defense and yeah this is arguably one of the best uh here i'll show you my fully upgraded as you can see um the chest piece gives you a shitload and then the arms give you roughly 20 each uh the helmet's a little weak but yeah, these are all fully upgraded and uh then i got i'm wearing military fatigues underneath which i upgraded with the um ballistic weaves if you want to know how to get those i can make a separate video if you want because you can make any sort of thin clothing that you can wear underneath armor you can make it hella strong as you can see uh my military fatigues give a ridiculous amount of defensive stats so i can make a video about that if you guys request it but uh thank you guys for watching and if you want to see more fallout content you subscribe to me like the video you know where to be and i will definitely see you guys in my next video, so take care.